And in addition to repeating my number three, four, or five times, I'm also going to have about three rectangles. Things in odd numbers work really well in art, so I'm going to have three rectangles that are going to be very different sizes, and I'm going to have a central point. It does not need to be in the center. It just needs to be a point that everything's going to ra radiate out of. So let's say I really want this four to be the focal point. I could make the center right here. I could make it right here. And on my design, I'm going to have about seven lines and they don't need to be evenly spaced. I can do one like really skinny like this and then I can then I can do another that's much wider. So I'm going to do all of this design work on the front and yes, they can overlap. The rectangles can go over the numbers. The um, lines can cut through it. I can have my, my third rectangle and then I'll keep radiating these lines out. So this is a quick little sketch of what I'm going to do on the front, but it's going to be on top of the blue paint so it won't show up as clearly. clearly. So I just do this little, this little sense what's going to happen there. And remember, I am going to have other number fours repeating and I can repeat that process. And those can also overlap. It's okay to have, have anything that you want to overlap, anything else.